It is that time of year when we feel like we've had a cold. It just seems like it won't go away. It's irritating. And the thing is, though, it really may not be a cold at all. Hmm. News 5's Meg Shaw spoke with a local doctor about winter allergies and how hard it is to get rid of them. And now that the cold weather is here, we've all closed up our houses. We're keeping the doors closed, but there are several things you can do around the house to minimize your symptoms. So if you're sneezing, coughing, feeling wheezy, or your eyes are itching, and you typically get those outdoor allergies, chances are your indoor allergies are flaring up. Dr. Sandra Hong from the Cleveland Clinic says pet dander, dust mites, mold, and cockroach droppings can trigger you even more. So she recommends getting dust mite covers for your pillows and your mattresses, washing your pet once a week, cleaning damp areas often like the kitchen and the bathroom. And then she also says if you use a humidifier for the dry air, uh, she warns that you have to be careful of how often you're running it. The only problem is if you don't keep control over the amount of humidity that are in your homes, you'll actually, you can actually cause these dust mites and mold to basically just grow. So you want one that you can check the humidity and you want it below 50%. And another piece of advice for parents with kids in bunk beds. It is important to cover their mattresses and even switch them from time to time so that the kid on the bottom bunk isn't having dust mites fall on them night after night. For News 5, I'm Meg Shaw.